And now at five, a two-year-old boy is rushed to the hospital after taking a frightening fall from a balcony. CBS 4's Tiani Jones is live at Jackson Memorial Hospital with the latest. Tiani, good morning. Good morning. Well, this morning we're told that the child is stable and recovering. Most parents with toddlers will tell you you turn your head for one minute and they're getting into something. Well, the story began with a grandmother who did just that. Police tell us she was preparing food for the boy. The balcony door to the apartment had been left open and the little boy got out. That's when police say he somehow slipped through the balcony railings. The grandmother immediately heard the boy crying and couldn't find him. Finally, she looked outside and and realized the boy had fallen off their two story balcony. She called 911 and rescue decided he needed to be airlifted to the hospital. I can tell you, as a police officer, being a police officer for 18 years, it's one of the most difficult things that we have to deal with on a day to day basis. It's any incident involving a child, an accident of a child. It's very difficult, but uh, we always do our very best to investigate and at the same time provide support for the family who is obviously going through a very difficult uh, time at this, at this moment. Police tell us they believe that this is just an unfortunate accident. Again, as for the little boy, he is in stable condition and recovering. Reporting live from Jackson Memorial Hospital, Tiani Jones, CBS4 This Morning.